When I first time hear about the access inclusion panel when it first rolled out, I thought that this is such a great idea because being a user at a city, using all the city facility as well as public transport and also you know work, study, play and volunteer, I thought it's such a great idea to join to really have a voice for someone with a disability that is active involved as well. I acquired a disability some 16 years ago and prior to that I worked in the disability field so I've, I felt I was really well acquainted to give an opinion on disability matters. One of the things that the panel provided really valuable input into was the aquatic centre. The language was really quite negative when we first went there about disabled people and disabled people's access and the facilities weren't, weren't particularly good. And from where they've come to where they are now and the input that we had, it's really quite wonderful. And it's groundbreaking really and I, I think it's something that everybody should be very proud of for the way that they've embraced what we said. I've been involved in quite a number of different panels and committees and communities discussion. Adelaide City Council Access Inclusion Panel is probably one of the only panel that is really listened to each and every one individuals and really take it into account. By being on this panel we've been able to give quite, quite professional advice but it comes most often from personal experience. It also comes from other people on the panel too that actually it is their profession, but there's nothing quite as confronting as actually facing a disability yourself and being on the panel. We're able to give that advice from a very personal point of view to the people who are responsible for making inclusion possible within the city.